Everyone, this is Tim from Your Six Tech. Today in the studio, I'm going to show you how to fix your L3 button not working and you're not able to sprint in some games. Maybe you just try to sprint and then you start walking. Now, the first thing you should try is resetting your controller by holding down the sync button on the top of the Xbox One controller. Hold this down for about 10 to 15 seconds and your controller will vibrate two times and then it will turn off and that will mean it's disconnected from your Xbox One. And then we will want to go ahead and reconnect it. So it vibrated twice. I'm going to turn this on. Now go to the front of your Xbox One and hold down the sync button on the top of the controller at the same time you hold down the sync button on the Xbox One. So the Xbox One light is right here. On the bottom should be the sync button. Let's hold both these down at the same time. I'm going to hold it down for about 5 to 10 seconds. I can see they're blinking about the same time. Now I'm going to go ahead and let go and they should be in sync now and you should be reconnected. So if that doesn't work, Another thing that we want to try is manipulating the thumbsticks. So what we want to do is rotate this around 30 times to the right, then rotate it to the left about 30 times, then push in your thumbstick and be a little bit more forceful, a little bit more force than normal and press it in and do this for about 10 times. Then take your thumbstick and lift it up and it should pop up maybe like a few centimeters and then push it back down lift it back up and do this about 10 to 15 times just in case there's something inside your controller like dust that's on the sensors for the thumbstick and it's messing up how it actually detects the signal. Well once we do this now what we want to do is take some sort of compressed air otherwise what we could do is use our mouth and we could blow in the sides here move your thumbstick to the left and just take some compressed air and just blow into the opening, then rotate it the other way and blow in it this way. Just to make sure that we don't have any dust in our controller that is messing up the sensors. Do it from this angle as well. And just do it from the top, bottom, left, and right. Also, you could just use your mouth. So just move it to the left. And try getting a good blow into your controller. Maybe that's the reason why it's not working. But for me, th this sometimes actually fixes the issue and I don't have to open up my controller. Now, some games might have like an auto run feature where all you have to do is press up on the thumbstick and you don't have to click it in. Otherwise, you could try remapping your sprint button to maybe a different thumbstick. You can maybe swap it with this one so you're actually sprinting with the right thumbstick if your controller is the only one you have and you don't have another one, you could try doing that and you remap the controls. But hopefully this video did indeed help you out. If it did, leave it a big thumbs up. And subscribe to my channel down below for more tech up videos coming up next on Your 6 Tech.